What's up everybody and welcome back to Bonte Garage. Today we are opening this package that a company called Last Fit sent to me. So it finally came in the mail right here. Don't mind my table. I'm gonna be having a Halloween party here soon. But they sent me this package, really nice packaging. Let me go open it up for you guys and check this product out. It's actually a HID lighting kit for the Honda CRZ. Should be a plug and play, so it looks really good. Pretty legit. Oh, got some free decals too. Hell yeah. Manual, and there we go. So check that out. I thought this would be something with like a ballast or whatnot, but this is gonna be a plug and play application. Let's go ahead to the garage. All right, so we're in the garage, and before anything, I had to reverse park the CRZ. I'd like you guys to see how bright the headlights are right now. Flash this guy on. So these are OEM lights, right? Yeah. Yellow, for sure. My headlights are a little foggy right now. Has been a while since I got a detail, but super, super hyped. I've had this car for... 60,000 miles now, OEM headlights, replaced them maybe once or twice. And yeah, I haven't failed me, but it is one thing where I've noticed that I've always wanted to change on the CRZ because OEM lights just isn't where it's at. It's not bright. You see all these fancy cars coming with stock LEDs nowadays, and they're just way better. You see way better visibility, of course, blah, blah, blah. Way more legit. So let's go ahead, pop this stuff. Side that. Never popped your hood, which I'm sure you have. Here you go. Right there. We go open up the garage. Get this stuff installed real quick. Alright All right, guys, sorry, it's really dirty. Wow, there's just uh haven't popped this thing open for a minute. But we'll just go find where everything is real quick and swap them out. See if I can place you guys in a decent spot now that I know where these bulbs are. This might be a lot better with this close. Close the garage once again. All right, that's actually pretty good. All right, so you guys look over here. It's not this, this is your high beam, but it's this one right here. I guess we'll unplug it first. There we go. Um, you're just gonna turn it counterclockwise. Let me see if these have sides on them. These are actually the exact ones that I need. They should be direct plug and play. Go ahead and get them in. Maybe the easiest do-it-yourself ever. There was an old rubber there from the old headlight that explains a lot. There we go, now things feel right. So these keep twisting when they're in there, so I guess you just Twist them in there. Don't keep twisting them, they don't lock. Boom, boom, line everything up. And pop these guys in. It's one. Right. I think we should do a side-by-side -side comparison to see how that looks, because it's in. All right, now I'm gonna go turn on the light. Let's go see. Oh my God, hell yeah, you can hear it. You can see the difference. Oh my, holy cow guys. Huge difference. Holy, so this is it right here. If you can see, this is OEM versus the last fit. That looks so good. I'm gonna go swap over the other one and we'll be good to go. All right. This one has the battery in the way, so hopefully not hard to reach. You guys can't even see this one. It's all the way over here. Let me just go knock this one out real quick. Here we go. Oh my God, that stuff is bright as F. All right, game changer. Now I really, really need to polish these again. Get those headlights refreshed. Super hyped, oh my God. All right, the install is done. Huge shout out to Last Fit. I'll definitely put their link in the description down below. If you guys want some lights for the CRZ, for anything that you drive, definitely hit up Last Fit. I only have the headlights as of now, but boy, 
doesn't make a huge difference. I highly recommend you get it. It looks so good, made such a big difference. I'm excited as I have to drive this thing at night. What's up, David? What's up, bro? <laughs> but yeah, guys, definitely get them and check them out. All right, I'll definitely have a review down the line after a few miles, after a few months. My neighbor's leaving in his Cobra as usual, loud as F, unnecessary. All good, much love to everybody with a Mustang. But yeah, definitely check them out. Description down below. Let's get this car wash done and to the shoot. All right, we're good to go. We got my wallet. We're headed to the shoot. CRZ is looking fantastic. Look at that. Damn. And here we go. See you guys there in a bit. All right, my dude is running a little late. We're already here. I think this is where we're meeting. Should be super dope. This spot overlooks San Diego. So CRZ is looking real nice. Really happy. Didn't bring an extra rag, so whatever. So he's coming here with one other person. They're about two minutes away because they told me five minutes about three minutes ago. So should be here anytime. See as he got dusty as F. They'll be here in a little bit. I hope. Like you said. Or I'm leaving. Just kidding. Got my fire red and Nikki's. Like these things. And now we wait, and I'll see you guys when it gets here. All right, well, it turns out I have to go find him, but I just saw him at the four way, so here he is, stopped on the side of the road. Turns out his buddy has one of the sickest S14s in San Diego. And we missed the exit, but we're good. I'm just going through the other side and they'll be right there. Oh yeah, the struggle of getting good footage. Hopefully it was worth it. Probably wasn't. <laughs> Ooh, so much struggle. So, what up, man? Sorry, I was getting a roller real quick. No, it's cool, it's cool. <laughs> good What's to up? meet you, dude. John, oh, John, right? Yeah. Ronald, Ronald. Nice to meet you, Ronald. I understand the struggle. It's all good. All right, this is the guy shooting today, Ronald. What's going on? Thank you, thank you for hitting me up. No worries, no worries. What's up, dude? This thing is sick. What's up, bro? Aldrin. Nice to meet you, man. Nice I'm John. You, nice to meet you, bro. Ding! I was like, oh, friend, legit. Brings out a cooler <laughs> car than me. Yo, what the hell? How you gonna park where you're supposed to park? Oh. Nah, you're good. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> dude. Man, this awesome. thing is sick. Thanks, man. It's a little stuff. Some minor imperfections. <laughs> Don't we all, though? It's all good. Damn. Dude, that river, dude, crazy. That's what I said when I saw his Instagram. I was like, holy shit, this thing's wild. So now we're moving to the second spot, which we're trying to figure out exactly where to do it at. But should be pretty dope. Hopefully we don't get in trouble because we're in heavily, heavily populated areas. As you can see, we're at Sam's Club. And yeah, should be dope, should be dope. I'll see you guys when we're all set up for the next one. All right, we're at the next spot trying to catch this sunset because the other spot at the lake actually closes its gates at six o'clock so we have to shut that down real quick but boy doing work oh damn we're over here on the back side of sam's club such a random mall area like 
Why does it look like this? It's super weird. You have to like, there's no way around it except for riding back here. And then you got Chuck E. Cheese over there. It makes no sense. But, hell yeah. These spots are legit. I would have never thought of this stuff myself. So, this guy's legit right here. This guy's legit. Definitely check out his Instagram. All right, guys. All right, guys, hopefully that cinematic wasn't too garbage. But if you guys like the video, definitely hit that like button, subscribe, and definitely check out the video next time. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have a good day. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.